here we go. Um, one way that you can do your lip and cheek is depending on the color of lip and cheek that you have, um, you can use it as a color corrector. So if you have those, so you can kind of see them in this, is a little bit of a purpley hue, bluish hue, um, and you can apply like a peachy pink over the top of that. And it should, when you put, you just do a little bit. Ooh, that's more than a little bit. That's more than a little bit, guys. It'll be all right. So I've got that little dark spot, sunspot, age spot, whatever you want to call them. And so this should kind of tone down some of that. And I'm just going to do this side of my face and then I will put my highlight on top of it just so you can kind of see um, how it corrects that color. Not my highlight. Sorry, forehead, how's it look? <laughs> anyway, um, found it. All right, so anyway, got the pinks here and I'm gonna take um, just, again, that pad of my finger I'm going to get a little bit of my highlight, depending on where, what you're wanting. Um, you can use your main highlight here or... Okay, so that's, yeah, you can definitely tell that that is when I tilt my head back a little bit. It's so much better. Get a little closer. Don't look on my nose, people. All right, so better, right? Okay, so you can use blush as a color corrector. Wonderful. Additionally, you can use blush as a lip, right? We all know because it's called lip and cheek. So I'm gonna do a little bit on my lips and I'm gonna use this color, this bad boy. Yeah, you guys are scared of it, aren't you? You see it and you're like, that is so dark. What on earth? It actually comes out really light in comparison, right? So really light. A good raisiny color. And you're just gonna dab it in. Remember from the previous video, did some contouring on my lip to make a lip liner. I'm just gonna... Bring those two colors together. And there you go. And look, goes really well with my sweater. Kept the sweater. Didn't think you would want to see me in my PJs, but I'm almost ready for bed. So anyway, gotta wash my face again and then go to bed. But, so good lip and cheek. That contour really mellowed out the pinkness of it, the purpliness of it. That's okay. It looks, still looks good to me. So anyway, so lips, color correction. Now we're going to move on to the next one. So you can also use it as a contour. Um, so you would take, this is nude, right? You're going to use more of your, your brownie, brownie, tan blush colors for this type deal. But you just get a little bit of product, come across, right? In those places that you would normally use your contour. I mean, it also can act as like a bronzer in this situation too, just because some of those colors can have that like sun-kissed look to it. So this is where this could, you could use it as a bronzer, use your contour, and then add this as a bronzer. Okay. Now you saw the black cherry on the lip, right? I'm going to show you as the cheek. So again, contouring, lip, cheek. So just going to Get that and place it. I can't see. This is not scary color. 
do not be intimidated when you go online on the website and you're looking at all the different products and you're like, what on earth color is that? Is that, how is that going to look on me? I'm telling you, try it out because something like that would probably scare you away. But just look at that pretty raisin color that you're going to get and you're just going to blend it in. Look at that. So contour, contour cheek, lip, and I'm just going to take a little bit more of that black cherry, maybe not that much. And we did that contour on our eyes earlier. Well, we didn't, I did. I'm going to do a little bit of the lip and cheek on as my eyeshadow as well. It just blends so nicely with the contour color. You can, this is my go-to, people. This is what I do. I am too lazy, especially at 5.45 in the morning when I'm trying to get ready for work to do a full eyeshadow. I just do this. My blush, my lip and cheek, and my contour. And I'm out the door, right? Like I do the rest of my face, people. But, you know, I'm just trying to make it as simple as possible. Do this. I think it looks good. So color corrector, contour. Lip and cheek on your brush, lip and cheek on your lips, eyeshadow. So many ways. Contour is versatile. Lip and cheek is versatile. The product is endless in what it can do. 